Hey guys, Repairman here, here to repair your builds. Alright, so we got today Neza. A lot of people want to know, what do you do with Neza? What do I do with this frame? Alright, well, several different things, a lot of things you can do with this frame. So, one, you could do a map nuker, those little spikes, spike, and just rinse and repeat. Just constantly spike them. Doesn't scale well, so only good for maybe Hydron 10 waves after that really takes a hard hit unless you have four cross projections then you might be able to go a little further without it scaling off too badly because they still their health goes up even though their armor might be gone um, and then you have the safety guard build with guardian you have more armor with str strength you have more strength of course and so we combine those together with the augment the safety guard augment now when you cast that warding halo you are gonna get like seven eight thousand uh actually you know what actually with oh wait no we're guardian now that that's a thing before it was like seven thousand without the arcanes but now that guardian adds a solid uh 600 armor to it i believe it's like 12 or 14,000 damage resistance that it, the safety guard or the warding halo gives which half of that goes to your allies their pets um, defense targets and whatnot very handy to have that uh, what you can also do is a CC build you know just spike them the whole map and then uh, just let them hang, just chill. And efficiency, so you can keep rinse and repeating. And yeah, and I just tossed in an armor so that the uh, that little warding halo on this build ha gives you a little bit of something to reduce the damage, you know, might as well. All right, now for the actual build that I'm gonna be demoing, this one is a more arcane critical build. You absolutely have to have arcane energize for this to build we're gonna go with crazy strength crazy duration we're gonna go with energy conversion so we're gonna go over 300 percent what is it three less than right well if i form it a little differently i could probably put a maxed out uh but i'm not gonna put another format just to have that one single tick of 2.5 energy so this build is going to give you 347 percent power strength with that energy conversion procking. Now you can do radar so you can see where they're at, a cross projection, a lot of several different ways you can go about it. I'm just going to do radar just so you can see where the enemies are, where they're getting hit and killed and stuff and we can focus on where we're going to run around. This is the Firewalker build. Of course we have the energizers, both energizers to keep that energy up and flow for a buffer and duration so that the fire on the ground stays there as long as humanly possible because we want the whole map to be just covered in fire everywhere all over the place because you're going to be running around like a madman and without further ado let's get into it And that safety guard augment build, that one's pretty handy, specifically when you have teammates that are really squishy. So you got a map nuker and you need to keep them safe. Specifically, like, say, Equinox, you're in like a T4 defense or survival and void. They're doing some crazy damage. They're going to kill that Equinox all day long. But if you can keep that Equinox alive with, say, Neza safety guard, maybe a Gara damage resistance, something like that maybe even toss in uh, or swap out one of those for a obron support build you're going to be doing some phenomenal stuff with that equinox then because of teamwork teamwork is always a, a good thing to utilize it's like a another extension of your frame all right so without further ado by a walker see so he's running around like crazy madman 
firefighter everywhere. Of course, when you're on here and it's moving, it goes and goes underneath the platform, so you're not going to see it until it stops moving. That's why you can just run all mission long. And who said run wasn't a good way to fight the enemy? <laughs> Never met Neza. It's a very rare scenario when running is an actual good battle strategy. <laughs> Let's see what damage we're doing. Probably some. Oh yeah, top damage with Firewalker. Eh. Who says Neza can't do damage? Neza do some phenomenal damage if used properly. And if you want to do even more damage, if you focus, especially if you got frames and people are doing some decent damage, you focus on making sure that outer ring is always filled with fire more than inside so they're hitting getting hit with fire right away he's <laughs> a fire in the air well that's firewalker and as I look at it, the whole, ran around this ring a good while back and still had fire down here St stays for a long period of time uh, you know, here, let, so I'll so show you the stats with the energy conversion prop. That Firewalker is doing almost 700 damage per second and stays in place for almost half a minute. Some phenomenal damage there. And, of course, takes some serious energy per second, three energy per second. Uh, duration helps cut that down from what it originally was, which I believe is five. So, not as bad but uh yeah so uh, something new something fun something to play around with hope you guys enjoyed it till next time keep those formas cooking